Hey guys, it's been a while. Happy Saturday. Hope you guys are having a good weekend and have some fun plans today. I'm gonna wait a second as people are getting on. Um, but as you are hopping on, if you could let me know if you're watching live by typing live below. If you're catching the replay, let me know too. I wanna know who saw this. Um, and if you think it's great content, feel free to share it, okay? Because I hope I'm gonna share some good details here. Um, so what we're talking about is CBD. Okay, so there's been a lot of talk about CBD recently, right? Maybe you've heard of it, maybe you haven't, um, but it is a hot topic these days. And honestly, I've heard about it in the past, um, but I didn't really start diving into researching it at all until probably like two months ago when I heard that our company is coming out with CBD. And so obviously it's important for me to learn about it. And then whatever I learn, I wanna share with you guys so you guys know too. So hi, Valerie. All right, guys, thank you for hopping on. Let me know when you're watching live. Let me know where you're watching from. Um, hey, Melissa. All right, and I am gonna dive in. I have my notes here just because I wanna make sure that I'm giving you guys all the information that I was excited to give you guys. Okay, so. Basically, what I'm going to talk about is the CBD, why it's important, and how you can build a cash flowing asset with it, okay? So when I got into network marketing, I never really thought that it would be something for me. I honestly had never wanted to get into network marketing. If you've heard my story, you know that already. I'm an introvert. Anything sales related is totally outside my comfort zone. I'm like the, the extroverted introvert. I'm an extrovert when it comes to my circle of friends. Outside of that, I'm extremely uncomfortable, guys. So like... The fact that I'm in this industry, I would have never thought I would have been, but I started it, honestly, for a discount on a product, and then I realized I could be really, really good at this, okay? And so I am coming up on six years in network marketing, so if I could do it, you could do it, but what I've learned to love about this industry is not only do you are you able to build financial freedom and time freedom, those are like the most important ones to me, because that, I feel like, is the most value I could give to my family is that financial support to not be stressed, to cut that out of our stressful life. You know what I mean? To to be able to remove that financial stress from our family, that's awesome, right? But that time that I'm able to give my family is like so important because as you guys know, as all you parents know, the days are long, but the years go fast, right? And so that time is very, very important to me. So that's what I love about this industry. Um, in addition to that, I love that it is a cash flowing asset. I love being able to make money in my sleep, which sounds cheesy and I'm sure there's a lot of people who are like skeptics of that and that's okay because oftentimes the skeptics, once they understand it, they end up being the best at this, okay? So thank you guys for hopping on and I'm gonna get going. So there's been a lot of talk about CBD and I know that I was totally this person but I'm like, oh my gosh, isn't CBD practically marijuana? <laughs> and you know, I was clueless, right? I wasn't educated, I had no idea what it was, and I was like, I wanna use CBD, like I don't wanna get high, and that's just not my thing. If it's your thing, that's great, and I know it helps a lot of people, but that was just my ignorant thinking of not really understanding what it is. Um, but guys, what I've learned is that broccoli has CBD, okay? CBD is not the chemical that gets you high. What gets you high is THC. CBD is completely is a completely different component than THC. So CBD itself does not get you high. It's when you combine CBD and THC. It's that THC component that gets you high. But for people who are like so hesitant, like, oh my gosh, I can't, you know, I go to church, I do this. Like, I can't, my mom would be so ashamed if she found out I was using CBD. It's okay. If you're eating broccoli, you're consuming CBD. It's a natural component. It's a natural thing, okay? So I thought that was very interesting and that may make you guys feel like more open to trying it because what I've also learned is that CBD literally helps like everything. I've met people who use CBD to fight cancer, to help with the anxiety, PTSD, to help like better sleep, to help with your aches and pains. Literally so many different reasons and it's actually really, really exciting. So I'm excited to try it myself um, and I want to hear your guys' stories if you have. So Post below also, if you do currently use CBD, what you use it for, how it's helped you, because I am legit curious to hear about it, and it's exciting to me to hear all the stories. So, with that said, willful, it, willful ignorance will cost you millions, so don't be that person. Take time to educate yourself um, on what's going on in the marketplace from an economic standpoint and from a trend standpoint. So, I had... 
little bit of ignorance when it came to this just a couple months ago until I heard about it and started to dive into it, okay? And so once you start looking into it, you'll start to understand. Um, Forbes has predicted that um, CBD, that industry, is going to grow by 700% by the year 2021, okay? And so a lot of people are really looking to get into CBD and to get into that and figure out a way to invest in it or start a business or grow it. Everybody is trying to find you know, their avenue of how they can take advantage of this. And some people might think like, oh, it's oversaturated, when really it's not. Last year they did $202 million, and with the prediction of where they're going, we are not saturated at all. CBD is not saturated at all. So now's the time to get involved in that industry and figure out how you can make it work for you. Um, in addition to that, December 20th is when Congress just passed the Farm Bill. Perfect timing, right? We just released CBD yesterday. So like, just the timing of it is crazy. Um, also, Robert Kiyosaki, let me know below. Do you know Robert Kiyosaki? Yes or no? He's awesome. I didn't know him until like a year ago. He's an author and like a business guru. Um, if you're in real estate, I bet you know him and you probably really, really admire him. And so if you subscribe to real estate, you better know that he also subscribes to network marketing and he has made loads of money, truckloads of money, okay? He's a very, very successful guy. And he said that if he were to do it all over again, if he were to start all over again, he would stick with network marketing because that's where he finds the highest quality of wealth, guys. That's his words, not mine. So he has written the books like Rich Dad, Poor Dad, if you've heard of that. He's written, let me try to say hi to some of you guys. He's written um, The Business of the 21st Century. And in The Business of 21st Century, he made this prediction that says, the way we will be making, we haven't before, but the way we will be making money is through fulfillment centers. And you might be thinking like, oh, that's cool. What the heck does that mean, okay? What are fulfillment centers? All right, let's look at a couple things. Amazon. Amazon is the number one retailer, yet they do not have any storefronts, okay? Airbnb is the number one business for accommodation for overnight stays, yet they do not own a single hotel. Uber is number one for transportation, yet they do not own a single car. Those are all fulfillment centers, okay? So basically what, what Robert Kiyosaki said in his business of the 21st century is coming to fruition, and it is happening. Um, so what does that mean for you, CBD? How do we link this all together? CBD, so with Viseo, with the company that I'm with, Viseo is our fulfillment center, and we have CBD. We have a CBD fulfillment center that Forbes, Forbes is talking about, that Congress just passed a bill for. It's ex expected to explode by 700% by the year 2021. And if you're still wondering if this is for you, to me it's a no-brainer. It sounds like a great opportunity. It makes sense. The facts are there. It's not just hype. These are what you can expect because this is what is actually happening. Um, so stay ahead of the trend. You want to follow the trend, stay ahead of it, okay? Don't wait until everybody else is doing it to realize, oh, you were right. You want to be ahead of it and be the first to market. So we just came out with CBD yesterday. And why, I want to kind of tell you a little bit about our CBD Honestly, I'm still learning about it, and I'll be truthful with that. I'm still learning, but I can tell you what I do know about our CBD. What I do know about it is patented. That's a very, very big deal. From As far as I know, I do not believe there are any others that are patented in the network marketing arena. And I could be wrong. That's what I think. Um, we have a liposome delivery. Google liposome. L-I-P-O-S-O-M-E. Liposomes have not, they're not a new thing. We did not like create liposomes. We did not make them up or you know, invent them. It's been in the pharmaceutical world for a really long time, um, but we use them instead of for pharmaceuticals, we use it for nutrients and supplements, and instead of synthetic forms of liposomes, we use all natural. So your body is able to absorb and assimilate much more than you know just a typical supplement or vitamin. And so the fact that our CBD oil is now in liposome form, what that means is that your body can use much more of that CBD. So. Live some delivery, Google it, ask me below. I'll send you some information on it that will make it like it's a visual short video, four minutes long. I'll send it to you so it can make sense if you don't know what it is. Um, ours is also certified organic. I know that's a really, really big deal for most everybody these days. It's organic, it is non GMO. 
This is really cool. From plant to package, all made in the USA. So I know that's also something that's really, really important to a lot of people, a lot of consumers here, is they wanna support companies and businesses and products that are made in the USA. So from plant to package, made in the USA, that's a big, big deal. Um, it is third-party tested. It is formulated with a sustained time release. Here's a good one. It has 0.00 THC. So remember, THC is what gets you high, okay? So when, when you have um, a CBD oil with THC in it, you automatically kick out a good amount of people who can't use it because if they're randomly drug tested, they can't test positive, obviously, for THC. They get in trouble, they lose their job, whatever it is. Maybe they're a child and, you know, it just looks bad. <laughs> so 0.00 THC, which is very, very good. Um, you know, more people might be open to using it when they know they can't get high from it. Um, and it is broad spectrum. So that is the details that I know so far about it. It comes in like a dropper for oil form that you take sublingually, and then we have a cream also. So if you are suffering from anxiety, PTSD, joint pain, muscle pain, um, Cancer, I mean, all sorts of things. I don't know, Google what CBD does and see if it could be a good, not a cure for you, but something that could help you. And then if you are looking for a way to maximize this CBD boom, I guess you could say, in this marketplace and build a cash flowing asset around CBD, um, then message me, let me know. I'd be happy to give you all the details, let you know what I'm doing with it and how you could fit this into your life, your schedule, even if you're a busy mom, even if you're working full time, even if you're single, whatever your circumstances, you could tailor this business to fit your lifestyle and your goals. So thanks for tuning in. Again, let me know um, if you're watching live, if you're on, I'd love to hear from you and I will talk to you guys soon.